Good day everyone, welcome to video tutorials. Today I'll show you how to make use of reference images to help you to create a 3D model. Okay, this, uh, the preparation to set up the reference images was done in the previous tutorial. So now we just create a box in the top view. Okay, the length segment will be 3, the width segment will be 5, and the height segment will be 2. Now we go to modify panel, press alternate X so that the selected objects will become see through. Let's change the length, decrease it. Okay, let's click on the move tool and change the Y coordinate to 0 so it'll be centered here in the 0 axis at the 0 position. Let's adjust the length a bit until it fits the tank body. And let's adjust the height also. Let's decrease the height a bit. Okay, let's go to move to let's select the front view, then press alternate W to scale up. Uh, to maximize that view. Let's reposition the tank body. Let's decrease the width a bit, it's a bit too much. Okay, let's decrease a bit some more. Okay, this should be about the approximate size that we can use. Okay, now we change the name of this object to tank body. Let's type in, create a new selection set called tank body also. Okay, then press enter. Okay, now let's right click on this object and select convert to editable poly. Then click on the plus sign here and select vertex to enter vertex editing mode. Let's select the vertex here, adjust its position a bit. Select the vertex here, adjust the position a bit also. Let's zoom in a bit using the mouse wheel to scroll up. We should also cause it to zoom in. Let's select this vertex here, then move it inwards to fit the reference image. Select the vertex here, then move it until the approximate position where the turret will be later. Let's select this vertex and then move it until it's at the position where the turret will be later. Then let's select this and sorry so like these vertices and move them up to fit the reference image better and zoom in some more and select so these vertices and them to the right a bit to fit the vertex a bit better shape of the reference image a bit better now let's select all these vertices here and move them up a bit fit the shape of the vertex a bit better. Now let's sorry, let's move it up a little bit more. Okay, that should be it. Now let's select this vertex and move this up to fit the body of the tank more closely. Okay, let's click on add the poly again. Press alternate W to go back to the normal view. Press zoom extends all to maximize view in all viewports. Let's press alternate X so to toggle off the see through mode. Right click on perspective view, press alternate W to maximize that view. It is the part one of creating a tank or creating a tank or modeling a tank. Thank you for listening.